seven ways crypto will be used in the real world. Because let me tell you, the days of pulling out cash to go and rent a movie out of Blockbuster are over. You do not want to be left holding cash when the world changes. I've spent the last two years talking about crypto and blockchain and I cannot believe how many people still don't understand what's coming. The change from cash to crypto is going to affect every single person on the planet. And the information in this video is going to put you in a position to benefit financially from that transition. And the best thing of all is I'm going to explain every single point in this video so simply that even people who hold their hands up like that to tell left and right will understand. 2024 is all about making content that brings the everyday person into the inner circle. So hit subscribe and get access to the information that could literally change your life. What most people don't realize about crypto is that it's not just about money. Imagine thinking that Christmas was just about Christmas trees. Thinking that way is narrow-minded and I don't want you to be that guy. And I'll be happy to admit, I used to fall into that category too. Using crypto for payments is not just going to be cheaper or more secure or faster for you, the person paying for stuff, but it arguably has more benefit for the entire banking system, financial system and worldwide economy. Let me ask you this. If you went to a bank and said you were going to save them $50 million every month if they just adopt one single cryptocurrency, what do you think they're going to say? And that's a proposition that cryptocurrencies like XRP are offering and seeing massive success doing so. So if we understand this and we know the specific tokens that are fixing these big problems, therein lies an opportunity to financially benefit from that knowledge. And the exciting thing is we have six more of these things to talk about. So a little while ago, I tried to send money from the US to the UK and it took three days. Why? How is a payment not automated and instant? The problem is there is big money to be made in that slow process that they call remittances. When I first started digging into this, I was completely unaware of how bad cross-border payments were. That's when payments are sent from one country to another. The payments take three to five days to even get to the other side. They're expensive for banks to do in the first place, and they charge you, the customer, extortionately high fees to do so. And you want to know what's even worse is that they only operate those payments within working hours. <laughs> it's crazy that that happens in 2024. And if you've ever used a company like Western Union to send money from yourself to another country, you'll know exactly how bad this is. It's expensive and it's slow and it feels wrong. But the solution to that problem is cryptocurrency. And you're going to see a pattern here, but XRP is solving this problem as well. They resolve the high cost problems that you find in remittance payments. And in the normal way of doing things, they actually lose money in the process, like at a massive percentage. XRP solves that problem too. The payments don't take three to five days. Instead, they take three to five seconds and it operates 24 seven. It fixes every problem. XRP is a no brainer. Now that we've talked about the obvious ones, let's get into ones that are less obvious. The most successful people in finance buy this asset so that when the market crashes, they're protected. This asset is also the sole reason I stay up to 2 a.m. sometimes watching someone pull it out of a river. I'm talking about gold. But there is an asset that's going to be right up there with gold. And let's face it, gold is great until you try to spend it. Gold bars, they're heavy and they're completely useless for payments. And in addition to that, you have to pay to store those gold bars. It would be really cool if there was an asset that could be a store of value like gold, but you could spend it. Well, surprise, surprise, that's what crypto can do. Many hedge funds and massive companies have started to buy vast amounts of cryptocurrency and holding it as a main part of their investment portfolio. And it makes sense to me that considering how much money these companies have and their track record of making money, it's probably a good idea for us to follow what they're doing, right? You have to pay attention to the way money is moving. And more than that, the technology that's moving it because that is how you get early access to investment opportunities. Seeing as we're getting more tuned in to the way the banking system works, you won't believe the shocking truth behind what the banks are doing with your money. 99% of people think that you put your hard earned money in the bank and it stays there waiting for you to come and get it out the vault. But that is not what happens. And actually, have you ever thought about what really does happen with that money? What if I told you that the bank makes their money from your money? Here's how it goes. You deposit your money in to the bank and at the same time, every single day, they take your money and invest it. And that's investing in their own investment portfolio, not for you, for them. Meaning they're using your money to buy property, to buy gold, to buy cryptocurrencies and anything else that's going to make them money. 
And all the while, they show you a number on your mobile banking app of the amount of money that you have in your bank. And that's enough to reassure you that your money's safe. I've got a challenge for you. I want you to go into your bank today and ask them to give you all of the money out of your account. They will make you jump through every hoop imaginable because in reality, they don't have your money. And that's why cryptocurrency in decentralized finance is changing the game. It's allowed people to manage their own finances without having to rely on the banks to do it. So the people that use decentralized finance have asked themselves one single, very important question. Who do I trust more with my money? The bank or myself? Those using DeFi have chosen themselves. So let's move on to the next way that cryptocurrency is gonna be used in the real world, and that's NFTs. Now, if you think that NFTs are just pictures of monkeys, throw yourself in the trash. Actually, get out the trash, I'm gonna take you to school. The whole world went crazy in 2021 about pictures of penguins being sold for a quarter of a million dollars. But everybody missed the point of NFTs. And you might be shocked to realize what NFTs really are. Look, I was even part of that whole trend. I bought and sold an NFT and thankfully I broke even, but the majority of people didn't. I quickly learned that NFTs were far more than just JPEGs and I made my moves accordingly. But the real use case for NFTs is potentially a massive revenue stream for the everyday person. I want you to think about data. I'm talking about your Apple Healthcare app data or your census data. These data sets could be loaned or sold to companies that will take benefit from that data. Imagine being able to get cheaper car insurance because your healthcare data showed that you are in peak physical condition. Or what if you could save money on medication because your healthcare data informed a research and development pharmaceutical company? The possibilities here are endless and it's all made possible with crypto. But there is one more type of NFT that you really need to know about. And if you're just getting started in crypto, you need to understand smart contracts. We're all gonna die. And when you die, your family is gonna have that first chance to take a look into your will, to see what they're gonna get. But the problem is in that process of your death certificate and opening your will and distributing assets, there are middlemen waiting to take their cut from your wealth. And to be fair, it's not your wealth anymore, it's your family's wealth but the world of smart contracts has something to say about that. So imagine a world where you die and all of the contracts, the wills and the distribution of your assets happens automatically with no middlemen. That would be really cool. And I'm telling you now, with smart contracts, the everyday person will be able to spin up legally binding documents that are completely sound and can execute the movement of assets at predetermined milestones. For example, the death certificate is uploaded onto the blockchain and at the moment of that happening, your digital assets get sent to a certain family member, your property gets divided up to these certain family members. Meaning all those pesky middlemen can't get their hands on any slice of anyone's pie. Now, please don't hate me, but if you're playing video games, you're wasting your time. There's nothing more depressing than playing a game for eight hours having gained nothing. But if you pay attention, there is money to be made without having to play the game. The gaming world has a really bad reputation, especially among the older generation looking at the younger generation because they think the young people are just kind of mindlessly wasting their life in a computer. And I tend to agree. And I was a big gamer back in the day. However, millions of people are engrossed in gaming on a daily basis. Where there are people, there is money. Tapping into this industry and making money from the industry won't come from playing the game, but rather playing the bigger game of trends. Within these virtual worlds, virtual economies are being made, marketplaces are thriving, and crypto is being used to do it all. The gaming industry is worth $347 billion. Don't you at least think the opportunity cost is appealing? Crypto is flowing in gaming, and you need to be paying attention. Remember, every opportunity starts with an open door. You just have to decide to walk through it. So this video has presented you with seven doors to explore. I've explored all seven, and I can tell you that each one of those doors can present you a new opportunity to change your financial life. If you're ready to start opening doors, you're in the right place. And the topics I'll be discussing on this channel will present you with limitless opportunities. But it's important to have a plan. In the next video on this channel, I'm gonna be exploring how millionaires pay less tax than you, but all the while are increasing their net worth. So hit subscribe with the notification bell on to be notified when that video comes out. Stay emotionless. I'll see you in the next one.